docket is 51567, Roger Lee Schoss. Ms. Truitt, would you... Compulsory discipline case, again, based on respondent's conviction for conspiracy to commit wire fraud in the United States District Court for the Middle District of Florida, Tampa Division. The petition for compulsory discipline was filed on December the 13th, 2012, and the respondent was served with the, com with the petition and the notice of hearing by H. Charles, a Tarrant County Deputy Constable, on December the 27th, 2012. Proof of service has been on file with the board since January the 10th, 2013. On July the 13th, 2011, the respondent was charged by indictment with conspiracy to commit wire fraud in violation of 18 United States Code Section 371 in cause number 811CR366T30TBM, styled the United States of America versus Roger Lee Shosh Nicolette Leasell in the United States District Court for the Middle District of Florida, Tampa Division. On August the 9th, 2012, a judgment was entered in cause number 811CR366T30TMB in which the respondent was found guilty of conspiracy to commit wire fraud and was committed to the custody of the United States Bureau's of, Bureau of Prison to be imprisoned for a total term of 18 months. Upon release from imprisonment, he is to be on supervised release for a period of three years with special condition of participating in the home detention program for three years in order to pay an assessment of $100. May I approach? You may. At this time, I'd offer exhibit number one, which is a certified copy of the indictment in the underlying criminal case. Exhibit two is a certified copy of the judgment in the underlying criminal case. Exhibit three is an original affidavit by me, attesting to the fact that the respondent is the same person as the defendant in the criminal case. And exhibit number four is the original certificate of Blake Hawthorne, clerk of the Supreme Court, dated January 10th, 2013, indicating that respondent is licensed um, and authorized to practice law in Texas at this time. On August the 13th, respondent filed a notice of appeal appealing his criminal conviction to the United States Court of Appeal for the 11th Circuit, and we are seeking an interlocutory order of suspension. I see we want me to admit your exhibits. Please. They yes. are admitted. Thank you. Um, and uh, we will, anybody have any questions? We will take that under advisement in conference and issue our opinion later. 